Yeah. Uh, right. And I would say, be careful of reading uh, this book around your kids, because I think uh, uh, my six-year-old <laughs> was uh, just, uh, you know, doing what six-year-olds do, playing, and, and you know, uh, my wife was working, and she just, you know, absentmindedly said, you know, uh, why, why do you think uh, God allowed uh, uh, the, the, the illness that shall not be named uh, to, uh, to come into this world? And, you know, my wife just, you know, was concentrating on something. She goes, I don't know, kiddo. And she paused for a second and goes, uh, the six-year-old goes, um, probably to, to bring people to God. Right. And I'm like, did, did my six year old just Romans nine us? <laughs> I was like, I, I don't know if that's, you know, yeah. the, the light of Christ in her, uh, uh, Lord willing, or if I've been talking way too much about your book, but I would just say, be careful where, where you put, uh, Scott Christian's book, uh, uh, <laughs> at in your house. <laughs> Well, so what about this this uh, the, this issue of uh, I noticed you have a question about uh, a trilogy maybe or something yeah, like that. Yeah, so um so you you've titled your books The What About. Uh, I don't know if that's uh, purely coincidental or providential, sorry, not coincidental. <laughs> um, uh, so what about free will? What about evil? Um and your your what about evil is, is going to uh, be a uh, more reader friendly uh, uh, version called Light Shining Out of Darkness: How God is Glorified in a World Full of Evil. I don't want to put too much on your plate. <laughs> Will there be a third what about? <laughs> well, if my publisher has their way, yeah, there'll be a perpetual, uh, you know, perpetual books from here on out. But yeah, we'll, we'll see about that. But no, I, I am contracted to write a, a condensed, more reader friendly version of, as you point, you showed that book in the beginning. It's, it's 500 plus pages. And it's some pretty dense at points, you know, uh, as you guys know. Uh, so I'm I'm going to write a a probably a, a 150 to 170 page book that's going to be basically the same argument, a little bit more practical, uh, definitely more reader friendly, more palatable for for the average person who may be intimidated. Uh, by reading the big thick book, um, it won't replace the big book by any means, Definitely. but it will introduce the argument to a, a, in a more reader friendly, uh, condensed fashion. So that's, that's what's next on my plate. Beyond that, I have a few ideas, but uh, I don't want to commit myself. <laughs> that's, that's, that's good, yeah. Your publisher might hear you and hold you to it. Huh? Yeah, that's right. <laughs> yeah. My publisher hears that, they'll, yeah, they'll be on my tail. And, and considering we've, we've been talking about uh, the, 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 the uh, compatibilism, we, we don't want to, uh, you know, uh, go towards tomorrow. We want to be focused on today. So <laughs> That's right. Well, uh, as Kyle Christensen, we greatly appreciate you coming on our show being the first person to come back on our show. So that uh, we thank you for writing this book. Uh, you know, like I said, it was, it was applicable. Uh, um, you, you talk about it uh, uh, being long. Uh, I, I, I would have liked it to be longer because I've, I've got so much uh, joy of reading it. And so um, they, they can, they can uh, pick up your uh, uh, condensed uh, version in the future. They can come watch our show as they then pick up the, the, the new book and, and you sure. can help walk them through and, and they can just keep putting it on repeat. So it helps us with the uh, viewership. <laughs> there. <laughs> so uh, th again, th thanks for coming on. Thanks for uh, um, carving uh, some time out to, to talk to us and uh, uh, allowing us to thank you for, for your work. Yes. Thanks for having me on. It's been, it's been my pleasure. All right.